What's good everybody, it's H back with another 12 Hub TV video. And today we're gonna look at a early hands off preview of a shoe that they leaked photos of back in February. And I think it was a precursor to the Road Warrior shoe from ISPA. But we'll dig into that a little more as the video goes along and I talk about it. This is the Nike and Matthew M. Williams Zoom MMW4. Let's go. MMW Matthew M. Williams, he is the creative director at Givenchy, one of the high fashion brands all the rappers and stuff wear, a lot of celebs wear, you know, those $400 t-shirts and all the other junk. And he has done uh, a lot of design work there and collabs with Nike on a regular basis. Same as Virgil Abloh. But his shoes aren't as sought after as Abloh's are with the off-white collabs. Uh, the problem with the being is that his are more neutral colors. He doesn't freak the shoes as much as Abloh has. And I have one of his shoes here, actually. It's an MMW uh, Joyride CC Setter. Oh, there it is. Yeah, CC Setter. This thing... Is one of my favorite shoes, uh, the C the the Joy Rides and the CC Setter uh, silhouette. I I'm just gonna flash this real quick. So he just he didn't freak it too much. It's literally just he, he graded up, put his little emblem on the back. He it's embossed right there, the Nike swoosh. Uh, same bottoms, the little beads. His um, it says MMW all the way around it. Nothing crazy with that. I like the fact that they put black beads in here. They usually put colorful beads in there or white ones sometimes. Gray, red, upper, laces gray. But other than that, the shoe is just a little bit pre more premium version of a CC setter. It has leather up here, leather patches all around it. Just a nicer version of the CC setter in a nice neutral colorway. Love it, great shoe. Two hours later. This Zoom. MMW4 is a sick ass shoe. What I didn't really realize until I saw it come out was that this was sort of a precursor to the Road Warrior, but didn't, it's dropping after the Road Warrior. So uh, going to the Road Warrior, this is a similar color to the MMW4, the Road Warrior vault colorway. So as you can see here, the biggest difference here is the double, it basically consolidates this. this part right here on the Road Warrior is extended out. The, this, 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 this here, but the, the heel, the traction, all of that is the same on the MM Zoom 4. And the two front Zoom units, which a lot of shoes have adopted, and there's no camel toe on that version. So this shoe is a very high tech version of what they're gonna put out with this MMW4, Zoom 4. And it's a dope ass shoe. From what I'm seeing here, uh, it's, it's, it's got everything that this shoe has, but in a more wearable looking model. Uh, the whole top is mesh, thin laces, regular laces, you know, slide your foot right in, all that good stuff. It's got the, the, just the touches, the MMW on the back, insole, um, the brand, Nike branding, all that. Just more simplistic, more refined, more wearable, more fashionable, awesome shoe. Am I copying? Yes. I hope they come out with multiple colorways so I'm getting every one of them. On the day it drops on Nike, I'm buying, I'm buying, I'm buying. And that's just me because I bought two of these resale and I still haven't worn them yet. Not because it looks crazy. It's just because I paid $800 <laughs> for a shoe. <laughs> this shoe, this one in particular, $850 something dollars. And I just have no idea how or when I would wear this outside. Right now it just sits in a box in front of my gaming station here, right? And I don't know what to do. I'm not scared to wear it. I've, I've put them on my feet. It's just that as I think about what I'm gonna do, like well, where do I go to Costco? 
you know we're about to go on lockdown probably again with this pandemic nonsense so i'm gonna walk into costco with these joints eh, whatever i can't go i don't go to no parties marry who cares no party in here definitely not going to no bars with some fool because drop something on it i ain't hooping in these i mean i wish i could but I'd have to hoop outside. I'd hoop indoors and you just try it out. Maybe that would be a fun video, right? Seeing the dude rolling up and down the court with these jaws on. That would be crazy. Got great support back here. Right? Actually, yeah, so it's got firm support. There's like this heel. I'm sure I get more spring in my step with these shoes. But look, going back to the, the, the MMW Zoom 4. Fire ass shoe. Take a look at these pictures. Rotate them around. Take a look at those pictures. The man has done an amazing job of and I, I don't know how many people were involved in the creation of the shoe but it is a masterpiece in my opinion it took all of the elements of the road warrior and turned it into something that's more wearable more attractive it actually has it also looks like a sakai waffle in the back because it has that double it's the same, same as this sort of like a sakai uh but it, it just takes a sort of cues from a bunch of different shoes that nike has put out that were different innovative and or popular and put it into one silhouette I, if they came out with some crazier colorways and freaked it a little bit i'd love it even more but this is fine neutral colorways are cool on a shoe that aesthetically talks to you you know this is sort of a neutral colorway you could almost say, yeah, it's plain, pale, white, whatever. And it's an awesome shoe. I'm not sure where I'm gonna wear it though. <laughs> but, again, MMW Zoom 4, keeping it short here. Tell me what you think of this shoe. Is it better than the Road Warrior? Do you think that Matthew Williamson or Williams or whatever his name is, is a great designer? I mean, he does design for Zimashi. I don't really, wear or pay attention to that stuff that's not been my vibe lately uh the high high fashion stuff but if uh i'll go check it out what they're designing over there um i love what virgil abloh is doing at louis vuitton so i'll give this guy a shot i do know that he has made it a like the th this is the only shoe i'm really familiar with since i own it and i've seen the two different colorways so if he does this this shoe is looking like it's just a refined version, like I said, of the Road Warrior. If he does more stuff like 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 this this Zoom MMW4, I'm buying it. I don't care how much this costs. There's no there's no set price. Apparently, it's supposed to drop in Europe first. I believe on December 20th. Don't call me on that. That's what they're saying in the early news. But sometime in the states in 2021, I'm copying, trying to cop at least. I'm trying to cop the european version as soon as i can um i'm gonna go actually go on StockX. i'll put a screenshot here if i do find it of what it costs on StockX right now uh resale and we'll go from there anywho like subscribe tell me what you think we also have the giveaway still going on love everybody's feedback and uh everything that's been going on with the videos you know my last few videos have gotten a great response new users coming in new new, new audience i love all of you and i appreciate the feedback and everything i'm going to announce the winner of this giveaway once you have enough entries that's also check out in the back we about to play some call of duty after i finish editing this video so if you um, want to follow me on twitch you can go there i'm not streaming just yet just hit the follow button if you're into twitch and check that out because we are going to start streaming a podcast there we're going to start streaming video games there and other things as we find more time to do these things still building out my studio situation my gaming situation haven't even cracked over my new xbox one xbox series s <laughs> yet it's sitting in the corner about and might hook it up this weekend but everything's all good it's going to be a great 2021 Love all y'all. Don't forget to enter the contest down below for the Fire Red 4s. Uh, it's a size 13 and a size 7 youth. I thought it was a size 12. I just looked at the order slip. It's a 13. It'll be in here next week. So thank you all for the subs. Thank you all for leaving comments. And thank you all for just being out there. All right. This is H, another episode of 12 Hub TV. And we'll see you later. Peace.